So today we're at Miyashita Park. It's in Shibuya. And this park was actually built the first time in 1930, but then it went under a lot of reformations. And, and now, as in 2017, it was rebuilt and now it's about three, four floors up over Shibuya. And it's an amazing park. You can come and relax on the grass. There's cafes. And I'll show you a lot of stuff. There's like a climbing wall and a skateboard park, everything. Here we go. So this park, right now it's closed off, but usually it's open and you can come out here to enjoy the sun, to relax a bit. The overhead wires will be filled with vines to provide some shade but it'll take another year or two for that to happen. If you need to take a break from the hustle and bustle of Shibuya, you can always relax at the Starbucks. There's also trees and grass to relax in, but you can come up here and you can see the Yamanote line going around Tokyo. see that there are a lot of people that just come here to hang out for the day, study, work, have picnics in the grass. It's a great way to relax while you're downtown. Even though you're way, way off the ground here, you can see you're surrounded by, by all of the skyscrapers. But it's kind of peaceful, even though you're in the middle of downtown. They also have beach volleyball here. It's kind of amazing on the roof in the city where you can actually play beach volleyball. I would love to do that sometime. And next to the beach volleyball court, there is a climbing wall if you want to practice your bouldering skills. Highly recommended. Everyone should come out and give this one a try. Then after you get past that, there is a skateboard park. Anybody of any level can come out here and try some skateboarding. Just to get an idea of how high up we are, let's head on down the steps. the park you can finish off by going to a Japanese style bar or small restaurant that is right underneath the park even in the winter time you can sit outside they have huge heaters out here but all of these restaurants are Japanese style food so this one has ramen very old style. It looks very old. Some of the types of food you can take out are like these. Also, all different types of... This one has Food from all over Japan and he tells you where it comes from. It's kind of cool. One of my favorite dishes is this. It's like a rice bowl with all different types of fish on top of raw fish, so sashimi. So that was Miyashita Park in Shibuya. The park was a wonderful relaxing place to be and then the restaurants underneath look really nice to go visit and have some nice Japanese food. I hope you all enjoyed it and see you next time. Mata ne!